everybody. This is Vicki. Welcome to Vicki's View. If you are new to my channel, thank you so much for stopping by to watch my video. I do appreciate it. If you are a subscriber or a returning visitor, thank you so much for supporting my channel. I picked up a couple of these little bunnies. Um, it is for a future gift. It has nothing to do with Easter. I wanted two generic ones for uh, so it could be for boy or girl. These I'm going to sell in my booth. I've been picking up a lot of Paw Patrol, if you notice. Um, I believe that it's a pretty good show, regardless of whatever's going on out there in the world regarding things. But to stay off of politics, I watch this show with my grandchildren, and I know it's a cute show. And this is the girl version of these little tattoos. Sorry for the glare. I'm trying to angle it so there is none. I think these are just adorable. Okay, so with my booth, I have pulled some socks that I'm going to redisplay probably next year. So I am going to put out all new socks and hopefully they sell. Uh, these look like coffee mugs in cat form. These are some dog one. Oh, and there's the other part. And these are little doggies with that color, with the stripes. Some more little doggies with a tutu. I thought that was so cute and stripes. I really thought this was cute with the cupcakes and that heart is fuzzy. I thought, just thought that was adorable. And of course the stripes. Then I also picked up some athletic socks where you get three in a bundle. So this one comes with pink, lavender, and I guess it's like a mint green. And I picked up gray, which is black, maybe aqua, let's call it aqua and pink. And then another one of the white, same thing. The difference is on the white, um, these have toes that are like that, these have stripes and toes. I heard a YouTuber say that this worked great on her car, that she filmed some of her YouTube videos using this clip with her phone. So I thought I'd sell it at my booth. Okay, I want a little, this is just some of the books I've bought. Uh, the next YouTube haul or video will probably show either all or most of those books. This one I picked up for me. I have not been good at following anything 100% keto, but I thought I would take a look. I kind of went through some of these recipes and it seemed like to me they were pretty easy. So I would say that I am going to try to give this a, a try. Okay, here are some children's books I hope sell. This is Top Wing, I've never heard of this one because probably because my daughter was too old to be watching it by the time this came out. I'm not sure, but I just thought this was really cute. And here's another one, Wing Power. And of course, got some Sesame Street, got Grover. This is not, these books are not easy to do with one hand. Sorry about that. So I'm just gonna show you this way, Big Bird. I don't know yet how much I'm gonna sell these for, but these are really cute books for kids. Um, I may not sell them for a whole lot just to get rid of them. I try to keep all my books no more than $3, even if they you know, might have sold in the stores for 10 to 15. These I might not sell for more than uh, maybe 
I might just sell them for $2.25. I don't know. I learned that everything I buy, like this one here cost me $1.10. Every single item you buy. That's why these, I will not buy these type of books to sell at my booth because I spend a dollar and I'm not going to be able to get $2.50 for this. And as you can see, there's nothing on it saying what the resale price was. So I'm just going to say that, you know, I'm not going to be able to do that. So these being hard copies, and unfortunately, also, there is no price because it looks like these were manufactured by Greenbrier, which is Dollar Tree. So I will probably price these um, no more than two. Probably, probably no more than two twenty-five. Um, I've been saying that a lot of my stuff is going to have to go up to a minimum of two thirty-five to cover the ten cents and taxes. These I'm not going to put out yet, but I just thought these were really pretty. And the paper, I don't know if you can tell or not, is looks like an ivory color, but I just thought these were gorgeous. And you get seventy sheets in these. This is something that I would probably keep, just put my, um, what do you call it, my, my notes in for, regarding my passwords, my computer, you know, like certain things that this, these would be great to dedicate to. Okay, I only picked up one of these. I wasn't, again, going to do it, but it was just too pretty. It's got 50 sheets. And if you can tell, it looks kind of like a, there was one that was open that somebody pulled out. So I looked at it. I, these sheets are a little bit lavender. So I thought that was really pretty. And these I picked up, uh, you get a hundred pages. And I think I saw somebody open them up there. The paper is tinted in there. And if I recall, there were some uh, decorations on them. So I just went ahead and picked these up. I don't know if these will sell, but I thought these were really pretty. I was unsure really about the feather one. This one actually feels thicker. It says 100 pages. They all say 100 pages, but for some reason, uh, maybe it's just me. But I hope somebody will enjoy them and buy them. I picked up a couple of towels. Uh, this one is for making margarita, frozen margaritas. I thought that was pretty cool. I noticed that these ones with the recipes tend to sell. And then I think I have this one before. It looks familiar. I don't know, maybe I sold it in my booth or maybe I kept it. I don't, I wish I could remember. But these are going in my booth. For some reason, the other ones still haven't sold, maybe because they're too thin, um, maybe they feel that they're too cheap, I don't know. I think they're cute for decorating, but if you're not wanting to do that, you know, it, then they're kind of thin. Okay, this one I picked up for home. I, it was the last one left, and I thought, okay, I'm gonna buy that and take it home. This is gonna stay here. And then these are going to also sell in my booth. This is the last two or three actually that I found in these colors. I think there was a couple more red, but I just decided to go ahead and pick up these and I will sell these in my booth. Now, not everybody likes this, what would you call that? Handle or hook. Let's see if it says it on here. No, it doesn't say it. I mean, some people like that because then their stuff's not sliding into the pan, but there's other people that don't like it. Now, this one doesn't have it, and we've already used the other one, and it's good. It's a very good item. Okay, everybody, that is it. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please subscribe. Continue watching my videos. That's very important to me, and again, I do appreciate everyone who is supporting my channel. Bye for now.